Hello, everyone. My name is Cerise Rennie Murphy, and I am an independent science fiction author and the founder of Virtuous Con, which is an online sci-fi and comic culture convention that is designed to bring independent artists and fans together in a virtual space that truly mimics the interaction, the discovery and engagement that is what we truly love about traditional conventions. So today I wanna to show you what Virtuous Con looks like and what makes it such a unique experience and such a powerful tool for bringing independent artists and fans together and connecting again. So let's go. All right, so now we are at Virtuous Con. Um, and as you can see, right off the bat, it has the look and feel of a real convention. From the sponsorship banners that you can see at the side and the bottom here, to the booths, and even the lounge chairs that we have for attendees to go here with their friends and just hang out and relax for a bit. So the space automatically, when you first see it, if you're a sci-fi convention goer or an artist who exhibits there, you understand exactly what's happening in this floor plan, which makes it really intuitive. So that's one of the first features that we're really excited about in using this platform and creating Virtuous Con. But let's talk about how you navigate the event. It's as simple as a double click. You go from table to table or even the lounge area just with an easy double click. And that's how you get around. We also have two banners at the top here. Um, we use a video of one that describes to people how to use this platform. Just a quick, I think it's a one or two minute tutorial on you know, how to double click and get around because it looks a lot different from your typical virtual convention with sort of the, the Zoom screen. And then we use the one at the right to highlight our vendors. So you can have program information here, you can have the list of the artists, whatever, you, whatever information you'd like to convey. And again, moving around is just as easy as a double click. But let's talk about how you as an artist would exhibit your work at Virtuous Con. And we do that with a function called whiteboard. So now we're in a booth and I'm going to click what's called the whiteboard function. And that's going to take you inside the booth. And right now we are at Lynn Emery's Lazy River Publishing booth. And she is an amazing author that writes paranormal mystery series set in Louisiana. Um, so you see she has her books here displayed just like you would at a convention. You can use the hyperlinks. I'm going to use a function called presentation mode. So it sort of takes away all the tools and everything and just makes everything nice and clean. And it also allows your links, your hyperlinks to get super clear and easy. And as you can see, I clicked on book one and it immediately took me to Lynn's sale page. I know that Lynn created this sale page in, using Square. So all of you vendors that use Square, this is a very easy, like five, 10 minute process and you can create your hyperlink that moves right to your Square uh, sale page. You can also, as you see, um, have a pop-up link that's also available, an option available in Square uh, to have signups for your newsletter, which is pretty cool. But I can look here, I can buy her books. And the best thing about it is as I'm doing that, I can be talking to Lynn and I'm gonna turn on my camera. Hi, so you can see me. And if I were the vendor for this table, I'd be right here and you would be, your screen would be displayed just under mine. Each table can have between six to eight people per table, including the artist. It just depends on the floor design um, and what you select if you would like to host your own event. Uh, using the Virtuous Comp platform. But yes, yeah, so we can be having a conversation just as Lynn could be explaining her books. 
I can adjust the screen so I can, can bring things closer in. I can click on things. I can be looking at her sale page just as I was before and still be talking to her, which very much mimics the kind of experience that you would get at a convention. So let's move to another table because we have all different kinds of artists and potential for displaying your work here. So we elected an author. Let's go next door and look at a comic creator. All right, we are here now at TJ Sterling's Ray Comics booth. And again, I'm going to go down, click the whiteboard function. As you can see, I'm still here as I'm waiting. So if TJ were here, I'd be talking to him. He'd be welcoming me uh, to his booth. And then we see a very different setup. One of the great things about the whiteboard function is that you can tailor it however you want. So uh, Ray Comics offers a lot of different things. So he's a visual artist. So you've got these great displays here. You've got his comics and he's got the hyperlink to his comics. He also has t-shirts that you can buy. Um, you've got prints. He also has a link to his site, he has a link to his mailing list, uh, a link directly to buy prints. So all of this is set up, you know, to express what his business is and all the things that you can do with it. And again, these hyperlinks are really super easy to install and they bring me right to the page where I can buy his work, I can look at it. And again, all of that's happening while we're still talking, just like at a real live convention. So that's another possibility. Um, let's see. I also wanted to show you someone who did some ceramics because you might be thinking, okay, well, I'm not a comic book creator or an author. How would I display my work? Well, we're going to go down to Dragon Belly Ceramics and again, click on the whiteboard function. and it's gonna open up to display some of her work. So again, it comes in pretty small. And as you can see, so I just expand my screen and each person controls their own whiteboard. So if um, LJ were here, she's the creator of Dragon Belly, she would be where I am welcoming you. And I can expand my screen. Someone else who was in her booth could, you know, maybe her, theirs came in big. Every computer is different in device and they could reduce it. And so they could be customizing what they want to see. They can be moving around. Um, LJ put videos of her actually spinning, which is really cool. So you can actually see how she created this stuff, which is something you could not do um, at a normal convention. So this is just an example of how you might display something that's not, you know, a graphics or comics or visual arts. All right. So those are just some ideas of the powerful ways that you can use the whiteboard to display and show your work. Last thing I want to share with you is capacity. So right now we have 15 people on this floor plan design and we have one floor. Virtuous Con, we can have 15 people uh, on a floor. We can have up to seven floors and 15 vendors on each floor. We can also run three events simultaneously, each event with a capacity of 500 people. So we could have two uh, floor plans like you see here, or we could have um, three floor plans, or we could have two floor plans and a panel all running simultaneously. Um, between and each event can be between five to eight hours. So with a capacity of 500 people at any given time at an event with three events running simultaneously. And we can make easy links using one of these sponsor banners. So your attendees can just click and head to the next floor of the next event. So it's a pretty seamless process for them, but it allows you to build capacity and make your con available to as many vendors, artists, or activities as you'd like to do. So that is Virtuous Con, um, or an introduction to Virtuous Con. Um, 
If you have any questions or would like to host your own event using the VirtuousCon platform, please email us at info at virtuouscon.com. And thanks so much for uh, letting me show off our virtual convention. We're really excited about it. And we look forward to working with you. Take care.